Hi guys, Jason Mackey with your one minute penguins update for Saturday, November 21st. We're here post morning skate with the Sharks in town, and that means Paul Martin. Uh, Paul Martin, always a good one to talk to. His media scrum kind of, I don't know, and went the way he plays soft spoken, quiet. Uh, but Martin is somebody the penguins absolutely valued, uh, somebody they could use now. You understand why he left, but Paul Martin, he's never going to make a huge hit in the corner or a huge booming slap shot, end to end rush, any of that stuff. But little subtle plays, position, man. Was he good at that? Uh, a couple other things to come out of the skate. Peter DeBoer, the Sharks coach, he will not coach tonight for personal reasons. Sergei Plotnikov for the Penguins, he was the first forward off. Expect him to play and Daniel Sprong to be a healthy scratch. Mark andre Fleury will be in net. He was the first goalie off. A few things to watch tonight. San Jose, kind of like Colorado, has two really good top lines. Uh, they have guys that can score. Patrick Marlowe is one of those. He has 999 career points, too. So. It'll be interesting to see if he gets 1,000 here at Gonzal. Melker Carlson uh, is a top-line winger, good young player. Pay attention to him. For the Penguins, I'm going to be watching how they play with a lead. It's been a couple games and it hasn't been great. Uh, they get a 4-1 lead. You kind of want to see them not take any stupid penalties where you know, it's kind of the result of them not moving their feet. Stick fouls, Mike Johnston would call them. Uh, they're just unnecessary. When you're up 4-1, you want to protect that lead, maybe even add to it, and uh, you just play a certain way. So it's on the minds of the Penguins, I can tell you that. They talked about it at morning skate, or after morning skate, uh, quite a bit. We'll see if they put it into action tonight. Jason Mackey, your one-minute Penguins update.